And let's go for the next room, which is Lance, of course. The last of the Elite Four. The fourth Elite Four member, I should say. Because we all know the champion's arrival. So, let's see here. I'm going to use a Forest Roar on Blaster. Well, Blaster fainted, right? Dang it. Okay, I'm going to use a Rive on Blaster. And another Pokemon. Another one of my Pokemon. Yeah, Thunder. So, let's use... Dang, it won't have any effects. Sorry, I misclicked. Okay. So, I'm going to use a Rive on Blaster. And we use another revive on Thunder. I'm gonna use a bunch of hyper potions basically now. So hyper potion on Chelsea. Hyper potion on Alpha. Okay. Next we can use the hyper potion on Blaster. So let's do that. And finally, we'll use the Hyper Potion on Thunder. I believe that land starts with this Gyarados, so I'll probably put Thunder up front again. Like the first time we battle Lance, so that's good. Unless he switched it up somehow. Yeah, I know he has a Kingdra too this time around, which is going to be hard to take down. It's going to be like his most difficult Pokemon. At least that's what I can remember of him, <laughs> the Kingdra is just not fun to deal with. Anyway, let's talk to Lance. Ah, so you returned, Grodel. I lead, I lead the Elite Four. Uh, you can call me Lance the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. That's virtually, they're virtually indestructible. Th there's no being clever with them. Well, are you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me, Grodel. We'll see about that, Lance, in this rematch. We'll see what you got. Okay, what if Lance would like to battle? Gyarados, okay. I was out with the Gyarados being up front first. It's gonna use Intimidate or have Intimidate as their ability. That's okay though, because Thunderbolt's a special attacking move. So, that's good. Oh, there goes the Gyarados, nice. Okay. Aerodactyl. Let's see, how much does a Thunderbolt do on an Aerodactyl? Oh, shoot. Yeah. I kinda. I was, if I was smart, I would realize that, you know, Aerodactyl has Earthquake, but nope. Of course not. I oh, didn't faint it. So. He's gonna use a full store, so I might as well use a full store. I'm gonna keep Thunder out just to just to, um see what Thunder can actually do. Hopefully Thunder can be very successful with against this Aerodactyl. So I'm gonna use a full store, he's probably gonna use a full store. I knew it. Okay, that's okay though. That's okay. I predicted his move. I'm also using an item like me. And I don't I need me go back to my bag. But um I'm gonna go for a Thunder. And hope that it hits. I don't have Rain Dance up. I'm faster than it, surprisingly. Aerodactyl is a fast Pokemon. It's like one of the fastest Pokemon in this game. I don't know how I get spread it, but I'll take it. And the Thunder hits, so that's good. And the Aerodactyl goes down. So there we go. Thunder grew to level 71 now, so that's awesome. And you have Dragon A next. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have to switch out. Um, I bet this Dragon Knight knows like Thunder or Thunderbolt probably, but I just have to switch into Blaster and I'm, I'm gonna have to take a hit either way. So, we'll have to see what happens. Oh, it's, it's gonna use Earthquake, okay. I can roll with that. Because it's assuming that, Lance was assuming that apparently he may have thought that I just, you know, would keep Thunder in after that, but I didn't, so yeah. Uh, Ice Beam will probably do at least half or so. HP. Ah oh, man, it almost fainted it. Just another earthquake, dang it. Probably gonna use another four store. So I'm gonna also use a hyper I'm gonna use a hyper potion then. So see what you do. Okay. 
This hyper beam, okay. Okay, that's cool, I guess. Um, uh, surf, I guess. There we go, finish it off. Okay. Okay. Two more Pokemon. One's like Kingdra. Okay, there's other Dragonite. There's Ice Beam on this thing. I probably won't want to KO with us, so that's a bummer, I guess. It's enough to land your she is okay. That's cool. I'm gonna go for the Hydro Cannon. Use a four star, of course. Oh well. Hydro Cannon hits. Okay. Must be charge, and Dragonite will get a free move, free attack, I should say. Okay then, let's see here. Who should I go to? I guess I can go to Fumi. And use like Return or something, but I don't know. One more return should do it. I don't think he's he'll use a third full store, but I could be wrong. There we go, it should faint it. We can go from there. There we go, nice. And finally his Kingdra is the last Pokemon. I'm gonna go for the drill pack. The only thing that super protected against his Kingdra is a dragon type move, a dragon type Pokemon. So, yeah. And I don't have dragon type Pokemon, no dragon. I don't have a dragon type Pokemon and I don't have a dragon type move. This will be hard. Because it's, wa it's water dragons, so like ice types won't um, be super effective because it'll be neutrally effective. Neutral effect, neutrally effective, I guess. And, yeah. So this is gonna be hard. Um. I guess I'll put Chelsea out next. Let's use... What, um... I could try a Thunderbolt, try to like par par paralyze it, I guess, but... I don't know. Ah, oh, cool, it worked. It par paralyzed the Indra. It's gonna go Hyper Beam style. Okay. If Chelsea can survive this, yeah, let's go back and use a Hyper Beam myself. Hyper Beam War. There we go. Nice. Take down the Kingdra. So that wasn't too bad. Before we defeated Lethal Lance, that's it. I hate to admit it, but you're a, you are a Pokemon Master. You said that last time. And I am a Pokemon Master before coming into this battle. Lance, thanks for 14,400 Pokedars. I still can't believe my dragons lost you, Grotl. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. His name is Gary. He beat the Pokemon League before- He beat the Elite Four before you. He's the real Pokemon League champion. I'm gonna have to beat him again then in a rematch then, won't I? So, I'm gonna heal up, of course, and... I'm gonna use a couple- or three revives, I believe, so I can see my Pokemon fainted. Only two of them actually did. Okay, I thought three of them did for some reason. Okay. I'm gonna take down Blaster now. Or uh, not take down, but I'm gonna revive Blaster. Preferably. And then I'm just gonna use three hyper potions on the three Pokemon that I need hyper po healing. Healing, um, HP restore, I guess you could say. So one hyper potion on Blaster. There we go. Awesome. Nice. And. Choose another on Fear Me. And another one on Chelsea. So, there we go. And let's use... Let's put put a flying type Pokemon at front, because you want to. 
he won't have his Pidgeot in this battle like he did the last time. You won't have your, his Pidgeot in this battle. So just start with a flying type Pokemon and you should be ready to go.